Hi, it's a video message for Rob. Um, just going to do a few more checks that you requested on the uh, dump valve. Um, I've still got it connected and uh, working as it was. I'll try and place the camera down. Okay, so quick check on the throttle. So it's basically still making the same noise as it was before. I'm just going to whip it off now and do the hand uh, check that you requested. I hope that came out okay, uh, sound-wise. By the way, I've um, managed to bypass this valve uh, here. Um, I've put a couple of uh, bolts in and uh, secured the fasteners on, make sure I'm not getting any leak. Um, it's made absolutely no difference to the boosters, this device, so I'm quite happy this has uh, no influence on it. Um, one thing I did notice, uh, I'll see if I can demonstrate this now, So I use a socket like this to um, put inside the valve. I'm getting about three millimeters of movement on the valve when I activate the switch. So that's back on as it was before. Uh, I wanted to see the uh, boost gauge working as well when I blip the throttle, so here we go. Like I say from the cab, the uh, valve is inaudible. Only just audible with the bonnet up, and uh, I'll just pop the bonnet down and uh, show you what it sounds like. Like that. Now, the dump valve does go up to about... Oh, I'd better shut the back door, that might be a good idea before setting off. Uh, it's 
wanted to show you what full boost uh, it achieves. It goes, it does still actually go up to uh, the full two bars. I'm going to pull out onto the uh, main road in second gear and uh, give it some beans. traffic to uh, move out the way. Right, that's setting off in second gear. That's full throttle. Third gear. Fourth gear. So I'm getting, um, on average, just over one bar on uh, full boost. Uh, whilst there's a load on the engine, so um, the turbo itself is making full boost with it the way it's wired up at the minute. Um, anyway, I hope that helps, and uh, I'll uh, hopefully hear your thoughts uh, back shortly. Bye for now. Uh, incidentally, uh, Rob, one thing that I did notice in my previous video is that uh, I had the camera very close to the uh, valve itself. Uh, just wanted to give you a comparison. There we go, that's it for now. Thanks for watching.